It's not the absolute numbers that matter. It's picking the goal that you think is impossible. You know, it was just like the four minute mile. Why should it matter? You know, humans have 10 fingers, they like even multiples. That's probably part of this. I guess all of these records are arbitrary in a sense. It's just because they become the next step in our sort of sporting heritage and development. And I think that's where the two hour thing comes from. You know, why shouldn't we be able to do this? 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, hey! If a human body can do sub two hours, I think it would be the greatest moment in athletics. Nice job, Lisa. One minute, one minute till the start. When you plot out world records, it should take a couple decades to get to where we want to be. But no one's ever gone flat out from the gut before. That's what I think is so amazing about this project, is we're going to tell these guys, you're going to go for it from the gun, and whatever happens, happens. And that, I feel, is a recipe for greatness. I am 100% confident in the science. 100% confident in this is mathematically possible and humans can do this. If it was easy, it'd be done. If there's no hiding from the clock, we're gonna send you a long way, about as long and as hard as we think is physiologically possible. And we're gonna see if you can do it or not. It's about human endeavour. Why would you try to climb Everest? Why would you try to go to the moon? It's about the journey. It's about learning what our capabilities are.